Hello everyone, I would like to show you how to solve some machine problems in Abacus, especially in Abacus student version with limited number of nodes. Let's have a look. Here is the example, we would like to mesh this structure which is a uh, unsymmetrical uh, eye beams. So we try to mesh using the default uh, method. Okay, let's say we try to mesh okay, using the the default value of global size okay and then we just try to match and we can see that abacus gives the error message so we cannot proceed so we have to do something with our mesh size so one way to solve this problem is by re reducing the global size for example let's take 10 then say okay and we try to match that is okay we can see that the quality also not so bad and we can proceed and but the problem is uh, for the student who use the student version you might have problem in terms of number of nodes because in student version the number of nodes is limited to 1000 okay let's try to run let's see uh, we go to job and let's say we just choose uh, the existing job let's say job 1 Try to submit. We see, we can see the the error message from Abacus. So the edition is restricted to one thousand nodes. So we have to change our mesh size or mesh type. So one of the way to do this, okay, you go to the mesh. Okay, one of the method is to change the type of mesh. Okay, the element shape. So instead of using hex, we can use that, which is uh, the triangle shape. Okay, so now we can you can see the technique now become free so we can choose this one delete the match and then we try to match again using the, the default value just now which is 50 then we can click done and then we try to match then seem is okay but if you look from the front view we can see that the mesh quality is not really good okay but we can proceed with this one let's say let's try to solve this problem by, by using this uh, this mesh technique okay we try to assign the element type just use the default uh, one setting by abacus okay and then done then we can try to run we just use the existing job so click submit again still cannot okay when, when we use the element type um, triangle okay we create more nodes so it's not possible so let's try to reduce the or to increase the global size we go to mesh again uh, first we change the size maybe try to put 100 yeah still okay But again, the quality of mesh is not really good. But we can proceed. Okay, we have created 473 elements. So I think this one also exceeds the number of nodes. But we can try. We go to element first. Set the element type first. use the default setting then we go to job and try to run using the existing job yeah it's possible so we can either you can um, increase but there is some error <laughs> here we can see the error message so it seems like it's not possible so uh, the other way to improve this problem is by creating the partition right so we go back to our mesh and we delete our mesh okay just delete right and then we change back our uh, the element shape okay go back to hex that's okay done and then to, to solve this problem we have to create the partition we have to split the structure 
into uh, several parts, then we can uh, match it. So to, to create a partition, just use this uh, button, okay, partition cell, click this one, and then use three points. Okay, it's, it's like we create, we try to create a plane, okay, by using a, a three points to split the structure. Okay, so the first point, I um, choose this one. Okay, second point, this one, and the third point, maybe this one. So okay, we see that now we have split this structure with, with two two different. Um, segment okay so we have to do the same thing on, on the other side so we click again this one but create partition and then we choose the other side okay using three points so I will click on the same point this one this this point this point and the other one on the other side so we can rotate using this function okay and I click this one and say click partition so now all our structure now we have three parts okay instead of uh, one one section now we have um, three section okay we have three section And all our section is now turned into green, meaning that we can do the structured match. So in this case, we go back to our uh, mesh size. Okay, we can use the, the the default value 50. Okay, then we can create the match. Okay, same everything is okay. The quality of meshing also improve is better. Okay, but then we can proceed with the analysis. First, we have to assign the element type. Just use the default setting by Abacus. Okay, and then just go to the to job. We can run using the existing job. So, try to submit. Yes, it's completed so we can see the results okay so now we can have the results 